those of you girls who bought this book and doing home task, you know that I'm insisting that you draw your destiny matrix. And look, by a chance, I was calculating my mom's destiny matrix. I was focused very much on this program to show you. And this, I completely forgot to highlight her talents because they are not unlocked. They are not realized. They are completely fucked up and lost so far, yeah. Now to our compatibility with my mom. Here we have like energy 11 and this is definitely physical violence gonna be there. My compatibility with mom. Uh, she beat it me few times uh, when I was a child and teenager. Few times. Not a big deal. Uh, well, well, yeah, it's, it was a big deal yeah, of me sulking, me having my energy 8, but when I discovered Matrix, I realized why and for what, for what she was behaving the way she was behaving. It explained me a lot which qualities um, of my character, yeah, uh, she was helping me to grow with such behavior. And girls who drop in condolences in, in the comments, again, I will repeat, that's not a big deal that she beat it, beat me um few times few times i remember um it wasn't regularly that she was like coming home and like crazy psychotic beating me no it wasn't a constant physical abuse no 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 never but few times she really really beat at me and i realized since i have physical violence karmic tale yeah those people in a group to be physically assault in a danger to be physically assaulted raped etc yeah and my mom was actually helping me to release this negative karma from past in the most uh let's say non-harmful way back then yeah and only when i discovered matrix i realized it was few times on occasion not a big deal um, well maybe if i was more sensitive character like 10 or 14 or 6 or some some type of softy i would be crying or nine i would be crying and considering this to be a big deal but no no i'm a four and you know like no not a big deal she behaves this way by the way she my mom is, is having energy four in her karmic tale and she really behaved as a father in her relationship raising me she really put a role of a father including this few times she beat at me another time she beat at me um, before wallpapers when i was a child and, and her friend was coming home and i just learned to see auras of different people my grandfather taught me you know uh, and her friend came over to our home uh, they had coffee and i was checking i was peeping on woman aura because i was like curious child and, us. Um, and i said to my mom that uh, mom, 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 I seen her aura and she's not a nice person. <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> I, I was so excited that I have this gift. Like, I, I finally learned how to turn it off, how to turn it on on my desire. It's not that I, I'm walking and constantly seeing aura. But when I want to see someone else aura, I'm like, the Superman X-ray vision, you know? I learned to control my abilities. And I seen this woman aura and her, like, dark spidey intentions towards my mom and i, I warned my mom that i was like uh, mom mom i think oh she's like oh, and this and this and from, and from her to, towards your direction you know uh, i was like this this type of child and this this woman friend overheard and my mom slapped me on my lips like really badly <laughs> she uh, my, my lips were swollen freaking swollen you know and and told me to shut up <laughs> Like literally was attack on my throat chakra. That that was another time she beat me, and there were a few few more times, but no, already n not that significant. Another time when uh, another time was when I went for journalistic training to Kharkiv without like not notifying her. And by the way, uh, in in our compatibility with my mom, <laughs> we have we have. Where was this? Okay, 
let's focus on 11 16 5 so it wasn't regular it was like outbursts of anger yeah so sudden not regular and five to teach me a lesson yeah this all physical violence so no need condolences girls like uh i was talking at her yeah because of my strong eight because of my strong 20 yeah uh, because of my strong four, I was like, oh, I would, I would be uh, going about this situation with my child differently. Yeah, but you know, n you never know, you know, what kind of child you will receive, what kind of contract you will receive. Okay, so it went away when I discovered destiny matrix. This resentment, this, uh, you know, uh, it, it brought a lot of relief to me, actually. Uh, what else we have with my mom? Uh, quite interesting that we live at distance and I'm very happy with this, yeah? 8, 13 and 21. Now a karma literally in sky position, yeah? Uh, energy 13, you know, to, to, to be at distance, um, energy 21, yeah? Uh, we are very happy when we communicate online, when we call in each other, but under same roof, we have crazy passions, karmic tale. I'm hoeing bananas. If I'm in the, under the same roof with my mom more than one day, like, it, it, it's getting bananas. I'm going bananas mostly because of her 1899 energy. It drives me fucking crazy. I'm, I'm going bananas because of this. And we have cr crazy passions, karmic tales. So not recommended to live under the same roof. And when we're talking about love relationship couples, these couples that uh fights and after they make peace in a bedroom let's say and uh, they, they fight next time already with intention to make peace in a bedroom but since we mother daughter it's not like this between us you should understand this karmic tale mm. so girls <laughs> and it's more difficult for us to make peace after each fight so to to live a distance the most optimal solution in the visit card uh, uh 1866 so 6618 this is from love you adore you endlessly to hate you <laughs> you know <laughs> love spell lo lo love love spell you know uh, karmic uh, uh, karmic program let's say yeah karmic program uh, in the core energy 12 and remember when when i met computer genius when i was with computer genius in relationship i was in my energy 12 era figuring out how not to be a victim how start saying no to people yeah uh, how to start following my own desires and this everything remember energy 12 and not by chance like uh, genius engaged with my mother as well because he's having mm, energy 12 in karmic tale and this entire situation was like oh that was just like ooh, my mom is having 12 in karmic tale too you see here and genius not not by chance engaged with my mom and my mom my entire childhood she behaved more like a father never ever had a hug from her but she behaved more like in this authority way because she was a man in past incarnation and for her being a woman in this incarnation it was really tough it was really super tough for her so she behaved as a man raising me you know uh, we have another program on earthline hopelessness those are energies 1987 and uh, I made certain amount of attempts to change her worldview, make her more happier, you know, make her more positive, help her to, to change, but I'm hopeless. It's not working and I let it go. And that's for a reason because she's my mother and I'm not in position to teach her. I come, you know, I, I come in peaceful terms with this as well. Yeah, I said, okay, mom, if you if you don't want to listen about magic stuff, etc., and she's not liking this, uh, that's okay. That, that, that's okay, completely okay. On money line, we have burnout program, and literally goes when uh, our home was bombed and my mom lost home, um, I was buying an apartment for her. I was spending all my contest money that I won at Dukascopy and traded really hard to buy her apartment instead of myself, instead of according to 12, prioritizing myself. You see how it plays out. Girls, 
I love this bracelet. It reminds me of stars and silver lining.